I want to do a short video on uh, my custom Mosin Nagant. Um, I want to show uh, all the people out there that are purists on these things that uh, just because you have one of these doesn't mean uh, you can't customize it. I know there's a lot of sites out there that uh, don't necessarily like people customizing these. Well, this is for the purist. It's my carbine, Mosin Nagant carbine. Um, and it's going to stay looking like this. Nice and stock. But what I do have is my version of a Mosin Nagant uh, modern day sniper rifle. Um, this was a long barrel Mosin Nagant that I cut uh, eight and a half inches off of. Um, I machined up a whole new receiver for it, relocated the bolt, which I uh, machined up the bolt for it, uh, relocated it behind the stripper clip housing and uh, I did that so I can make a, a, a better style uh, scope mount. Gave it the pistol grip from the AR-15, the M4 collapsible stock, and uh, machined up the handguard for it. And of course on the tip here, the, uh, the flash suppressor. I have the uh, bipod attachment that I machined up and uh, mounted the, uh, the UTG bipod to it. Um, my uh, hand guard there is not quite finished on the mount, but you can see my, my custom uh, bent bolt. And it comes in, it clears everything, comes down. And basically, uh, this is my custom version of the Mosin Nagant. Uh, sniper rifle. Pistol grip, M4 stock, high powered scope, bipod, and uh, for a 1928 Mosin Nagant, not a bad looking rifle and very inexpensive. So, uh, this is the end of my video. If you want to do some quick close ups, you can see. Uh, Pan nice and slowly so you can kind of get a shot of everything. I machined off the uh, the stock bolt. Put my little logo there. And then I have my uh, knurled grip for the handguard up front. pistol grip. I reconfigured the trigger housing to kind of give it the not so much uh, Mosin look. Of course I didn't do much to hide the, uh, the magazine. Let me set this up over here. And Let's see the two rifles together. See how the bolts Normally it would be here. I machined all that down and I put it right behind here. Also modified the bolt slightly. Of course, if you don't know much about these, this is what it shoots a 7.62 by 54, uh, basically equivalent of the 308. Very high powered uh, round. I should have this out on Saturday and we're going to see how well it shoots. So, that's my video and uh, I'll give you the results after the, uh, the test firing on Saturday. Hope you like uh, my version of the modern day Mosin Nagant sniper.